Here are seven things you might not know about the city of Brantford. Now this first one shouldn't come as any surprise to any Canadian, but Wayne Gretzky, the great one in hockey, was born here in Brantford, Ontario. Now he was arguably one of the best hockey players to ever play the game. He scored 1,487 goals during his entire career, and that's an amazing achievement. But he is also known for saying one of my most favorite quotes, as you miss 100% of the shots that you don't take. Number two is that Brantford is the tournament capital of Ontario. Now it is no secret that Brantford loves its sport, but in 1988, it officially became the tournament capital of Ontario. There are hundreds of tournaments held here each year, both regional and provincial. One of its most favorite tournaments is Hockey Night in Brantford, which brings players of all levels in hockey together to raise money for a good cause. Number three is that the telephone was invented in this city. That's why Brantford is known as the Telephone City. Alexander Graham Bell, the Scottish born inventor, moved to Brantford in 1870, where he spent several years doing experiments on electricity, where finally in 1876, he was the first person to place a long distance telephone call to Paris, which is six miles away. Brantford commemorates this amazing achievement by giving him his own statue located in downtown Brantford. His house, which is located in Tutela Heights, is still there and is now considered a national historic site in Canada. Coming in at number four is that Brantford is no stranger to the small screen. Film production companies have been coming to Brantford for quite some time and this is because there is no shortage of historical buildings and sites that are perfect for filming. You may have noticed Brantford in some of these hit TV series, The Murdoch Mysteries, HBO's Handmade Tales, Amazon Prime's The Boys, and Schitt's Creek. At number five, Brantford is home to some of the GTA's best museums. History buffs will love the fact that Brantford takes great pride in preserving both the city's history and the history of the nation. Some of the museums include the Glenhurst Art Gallery, which provides contemporary exhibits, guided tours of its over 600 art pieces. The Woodland Cultural Center is also located here and it is there to preserve and promote indigenous history, art, language and culture. The Canadian Military Heritage Museum is also located here, which honors the memory of veterans and currently serving members of the Canadian military. Number six is that the daffodil is the official flower of Brantford and it is no coincidence because this flower looks exactly like the first model of the telephone and can be found sprouting up in many gardens throughout the city. And finally, some of your favorite treats are made here. Ferrera, which is a chocolate making factory, is here in the city and they are known for Tic Tacs, Nutella, and Ferro Rocher chocolate. Brantford loves this so much that it celebrates World Nutella Day in February every single year. You could say that Brantford is a pretty sweet city. If you like this video, consider smashing that thumbs up and subscribing because I come out with new videos every week about Brantford. If you liked this video, then you're gonna wanna watch this video right here where I go through another amazing thing you're gonna wanna know about Brantford. So I'll see you in the next video.